today we're running the weenie loop because <laughs> I haven't done it for a long time. I'm curious to see if I can run uphill. And also I've got a doctor's appointment tomorrow to check out something hurts low down in my abdomen. And I want to make sure it hurts. This should do it. There's hills. I can't run hills. Well, we'll see how this goes. The problem with the weenie loop is it starts and ends on city streets, so kind of boring for a while. I like dirt better. <laughs> I'll turn this back on when we start getting near the dirt. It's uh, Wednesday. Ordinarily, I wouldn't be running a Wednesday because it's going to result in me running at least three days in a row, but not back to swimming yet, partly because of the rib and also now I got this <laughs> I got this aggravating pain way down low in my abdomen. <clears throat> I'm gonna get that checked out tomorrow. Uh, hopefully uh, the doctor will know what it is. <laughs> and um, then I can get back to swimming. But I wanna make sure it hurts when I go there tomorrow, so <clears throat> it's one of the reasons I'm running the Winnie loop today. It's cause it's hilly. I don't do hills very often, as in never. Terry and I run Spring Canyon or Oak Canyon. It's flat. But today we're going to do the Weenie Loop, which has got some hills. The Weenie Loop is a, a neighborhood run. Starts and ends at my house. I don't drive anywhere to run like I usually do. As a result of getting in the end or through the neighborhoods on sidewalks, and I'm going to spare you that part in the video. The, the Weenie Loop got its name from Terry, who <coughs> called it that because it's a shortened version of the, of the Big Rock Park Loop, which goes from my house and, uh, yeah. So you call it the Winnie Loop. Very disrespectful, don't you think? <laughs> and we're uh, working our way downhill, flats and downhills here to uh, the interesting stuff. When I turn and start to, trying to run uphill up the backside of Cowles Mountain. <sighs> See how that goes here pretty soon. By the way, if you think you hear me breathing the, at all on this downhill portion, <clears throat> that's probably just my shoes. Alright, here comes the churn, get ready for the g-forces. Okay. Alright, now we start uphill. Yeah, I could leave this on the whole time. It'd be about a 18 minute uh, uphill video. That'd be a good idea, you guys. You might want to go get a snack. No. <laughs> I'll, uh, I'll turn it off for a while until I'm breathing harder. In other words, I'll be turning it back on real soon. Okay, I've probably surpassed last year's total of uphill minutes. I'm trying to tip the camera just right so this looks really steep. Probably all you can see is my wheezing face. Anyways. I'm probably going to have to throw in the first walk here pretty soon. I'm pretty pleased I made it farther than I, I thought it would. Hip and groin are okay. 
feel like my my chest might explode. But that's not a major injury. Yeah. I think I'll walk a little here. Whoa. All right, I'm running again. Up. Uh, I started running again because I knew this level downhillish uh, section was coming up here. <coughs> I'm smarter than I look. <coughs> okay, now we're going back up again. <coughs> I bet this is pretty bumpy camera work. <coughs> Can't wait to see. <sighs> kind of ignoring the camera, watching where I put my feet. All right, this probably looks like a, a downhill section to you on the uphill run up the backside of Collis Mountain. So, <clears throat> obviously it must be some sort of optical illusion because I swear it's <clears throat> uphill pretty much every step. Okay, I'm running again. I think I'm getting up near the trail junction here. Another turn or two. Yeah, there it is. Okay, another heavy G-force turn here. And... All right. Hip's starting to get a little achy, but groin's okay. A little downhill section there. You can probably see Calls Mountain in the background there. Oh, I'm watching my feet, not the display on the camera. <clears throat> I could put this on fast motion later, so it looked like I was really flying on the downhill there. More than halfway up now, I think. <sighs> Several more switchbacks and be done with the up. <sighs> you really got to watch your footing in this stuff. <sighs> All right, I'm gonna slow down a little here. Put the camera away and. See if I can run the west, rest of this without any walking breaks. Uh, this went better than I thought it would. Here's the end of the uphill, right here. Uh, I'm gonna stop for second year and catch my breath and give you a view of some of the scenery from up here. Mission Trails Park, the other side of it, out there, where we usually run. Alright, now I'm going to head uh, downhill for not too long. Now I'll run down this 
Jeep road here for six, seven, eight minutes, to, and then back uh, through the city streets for about a mile to my house. So I'll just turn it off here. The interesting stuff's over. <coughs> See ya.